There, hold this camera for a second. What's going on guys? My name is Brian and something this really cool happened. I found this coin and I want to show you what it can do. In today's tutorial, I will show you guys how to do this easy appearing effect on Final Cut Pro X. Let's start with the filming portion. Film your opening scene first. Find a location or place where lighting won't constantly change on you. Also, find some type of item that you want to use to throw on the ground to make your subject appear. In this video, I just used a regular coin to throw on the ground. Also, make sure that the camera is on a tripod the whole time. Now once you have all that ready, say your bit Hold this and throw your side. item on the ground. What's going on guys? My name is Brian and something this really cool happened. I found this coin and I want to show you what it can do. Woo! What's up? You'll need to do some acting though for this part and imagine that the person appeared next to you after the throw. Next scene, have your second person come in also have them act as if they've been magically teleported there. Make sure that you don't overlap with your subject. Try to stay on the other side of the screen. That's all you'll need to film. Launch Final Cut Pro and let's get started. This one will be really easy to edit. Find the first clip of you talking to the camera and place it on the project timeline. Now find your other clip and place that on top of your first one. Make sure to trim this clip and move it to the proper spot just after the coin hits the ground. Grab the draw mask tool from the effects browser and place that on the top clip. You will need to start placing the key points at the part where the coin hits the ground. So in this clip, I will start placing the key points around the subject's shoes. Once you have placed them, add some feathering and place a keyframe. Then place a keyframe under transforms and control points. Press the right arrow key to move to the next frame and adjust the size of the mask as you slowly reveal going up. I would probably have the subject fully revealed after 4 to 5 frames. Now you want to add some effects. I've included a download link in the description below to the spark and smoke effect that I used in this video. But definitely check out videocopilot.net. They are the ones that have provided me with these high quality visual and sound effects for this video. Place the spark and atmosphere effects on top of the two clips, lining up with the very top clip. Adjust the placement of each effect by pressing the transform tab. Also change the speed if you need to, like what I did to the atmosphere clip, and also add a cross dissolve to fade it away. Now add some sound effects. I added a hard impact sound right when the coin hits the ground. Color graded as well to give it that mood that you want by adding some color correction. I also recommend adding some shakiness to the clip, like someone was holding the camera handheld. You can do this by highlighting all of the clips and creating a compound clip. Then under the effects browser, type in handheld. Drag that on top of the clip. You can change the shakiness level as well. Play around with it until you get the look that you want. <laughs> 